It's good to be back in court, even after this great honeymoon. Say, do you know much about finance? It's okay. You will learn. You know, corgis do require a lot of resources. Quality foods that change every day, training toys, personal orchestras. Do you already have an idea about the budget you would draft for the dear royal corgi if you were its instructor? That's a good start. My wife is also a great planner. Say, do you have any personal finances you are planning to use for the royal corgi's budget? Well, that's what the crown's finances are for too. But do you think I didn't see you looking at my wife all this time? Good morning. The closest soldier to the king is his most loyal and last defender. He should be fearless, ferocious and fierce. A true soldier that should be taught by a cunning war master. Hm. Am I not interesting enough for you? You lack discipline and respect. Think, I think I can compete against you. Hm? 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 Aha! Of course I can. You know what? I think I have my own chances to get this job after all. I will plead to the king in my own favor. I broke you, and if I can break you, I can become whatever I want. No, I'm the fool. Of course you have the necessary strength of character to educate the royal corgi properly. Do you think that you'd be able to care for horses too? How arrogant! And lower your eyes when you talk to someone more important than you. Do you think you're as good as me then? I don't think that the royal corgi would be in good hands with someone as arrogant as you. Still, I see you have some sense in you after all. At least I won't speak against you to the king. Men come and go, yes. But art stays. At least that's what my master's taught me. But look at that. All I do here is paint corgis. Have you seen my paintings? Ha! <laughs> someone at least as cynical as me. Of course you wouldn't understand. It seems you are more fascinated by my corgi paintings than by my other work. Aha! I was thinking you were avoiding me for a second. Ah, uh, dogs, aren't they cute? Aha, uh -huh, good one. Of course you love dogs too. The King of France especially loves his female corgi, Lucette. Is there something happening over there? Someone important? 